Call of Duty just changed the Rebirth map for one day only, and it will never look this way again, at least for another 20 years. Let me explain. There will be a solar eclipse today, and they have changed the Rebirth map to reflect that, but the next solar eclipse is not going to happen until August 2044. I'm running Chad, the operator here, because he has on his solar eclipse glasses, and um, I also have some. I get eclipse. I don't know why I bought these, but we're going to be putting them on when the solar eclipse happens in-game. I am armed with my Renetti because at the time of this recording, it has still been unnerfed and is absolutely reeking havoc on this map and my DG LMG that has actually no recoil. You think I'm kidding? If you missed the upload on that yesterday, you'll see here in a second. We are actually also going to test two other Easter eggs. I have been told from reliable sources, if I honk the horn on this boat three times, I get a special thing. I don't know what the thing is, but I've been told it's special. And the second is that there's like a secret loot thing that comes from like a crashing plane somewhere in the water. So we're going to check that too. Let's go, Chad! Put on your glasses and get to work! Let's keep our eyes peeled for the plane here first. Where is it? I hear it. There it goes. Where are you going to crash, bud? I want my, I want my, I don't know, free things. Wait, what? It didn't crash. I guess they don't crash every single game. I don't know. We'll try it tomorrow. Subscribe if you're not already. And we can, we can investigate the plane crash. But now, I just have to stay alive long enough. I've heard my lesson. I'm not going to shoot you. I'm just going to melee you to death. Yeah, that's right. The butt of my gun is stronger than your bullets. Yeah, no, hey, that's, they're not wrong. Are they gonna come back and try to kill me? I would, they sure did. So you can see the sun is already a little bit different than it is previously. I'm just like, this is one of the coolest things they've done. They didn't do a whole lot with the map changing over the course of, well, I mean, El Masra, like really didn't change at all. Bounty, sure, why not? I'll take the AMR. I can't see you. Just kidding. I got you. I think there's someone else coming up here now. I better run away, reload, and recombobulate myself. It's a fun word. If you don't use recombobulate or combobulate in your day to day, you really should. Oh, someone else is here now. Are you up? Low? Too slow? Too slow. Oh, it's the same guy from before. He's probably quite upset with me. And we have another slidey boy somewhere below me. I want to make sure I'm outside as much as possible because I don't want to be missing the eclipse basically wait i have that perk on that gives me no it doesn't matter oh it's happening it's starting to happen i gotta put on my glasses now get eclipse oh wait i i can see nothing out of these what happens if i put it over the camera i'll try to i'll leave them on here like a good boy i prefer to be able to see things so we're gonna do it like this it's getting really dark like much darker than i would have anticipated uh-oh i think i might be dead i don't know i'm just gonna try to slide away keep my timer active Who's gonna win the Eclipse? I can't do this, guys. I, I would have loved to do the entire game like that. I just don't have, like, I can't. Mortar Strike coming in. Who's trying to kill me? SVA and another Ram 7. A bunch of legendary guns. Where did it go? Oh, there it is! That's so cool. A little weapon now. I'm just trying to think of what thumbnail I use for this. I don't know. Who knows? Someone's gonna try to kill me while the Eclipse is happening? How dare you? Let's get a better view from up here. That, that death was on purpose. I don't think you can see the sun at all. There it is. I mean, that's, I guess you can't see this sun at all. Yeah, no shit, Sally. That's what a solar eclipse is. I've always enjoyed these, like, I don't even know. I Like, in-game events, but also real-world events. Are you... Okay, sure, I'll do this for for everybody. <laughs> I mean, it had to be done, right? Whoa, all the loadouts are right there. Sure, let's full send it. I've always enjoyed these, like, large-scale events because very rarely as humans do we have the opportunity to experience something that, like, everybody's gonna have happen at the same time. Where did that guy just go? I need to put on plates. Wow, everyone's dropping. I don't love that. Fuck! Guys, Resurgence is so tilting. I was just having a nice kumbaya moment about a shared human experience and then proceeded to get my back blown out. Now I have someone on my prox chat. You gonna come up the stairs? No! Oh! This person's gonna get up too, so now I gotta watch whoever killed me. Imagine dying and then having to watch the person who murdered you run around and continue murdering people and be powerless to stop it. The eclipse is still going on. I'm genuinely curious if this goes on the entire game. It'd be really cool if it did. The other part that was super nice about this, see if I can hit this snipe. No, someone else did. The other cool thing it's part like the other cool thing about this is the fact that like they didn't put it out on socials anywhere. It just kind of happened. Everyone dropped in. They're like, wait, hold on. This is the usual lighting on Rebirth Island. Brother, hit a snipe. Thank you. Now get the clean. Split the uprights or just full send it. Ooh, this is a ballsy full send. There's a mosquito drone over there. And like... Oh, no! Oh, 
Oh, uh, now they're getting shot from the sniper up in the lighthouse or the guard tower, whatever the hell we call it. The very large building that people camp on at snipe. Now we gotta watch Cranky, who's about to buy their loadout. What do you think they're gonna get? You think a Renetti's gonna be in it? It better be, otherwise they're going to lose. I've never actually looked in the sides of that loadout thing before because I'm always like petrified to die on the load or like the buy station, but there were like scopes and stuff. I also just realized I never honked the horn, so after this game is done and I get some closure on my on my death and see who wins the uh, Eclipse game, I'm gonna go honk the horn, unless this person does it. There's two people there, one's up top, one's down low. Shoot literally any of them. Cranky. Cranky, shoot someone or honk the horn! I didn't finish my thought. I'm gonna be dropping in for one more game, honking the boat horn three times and seeing if I get a present. There you go. Shoot that guy. He just dove through windows. This is the commando. Now he sees your sniper blade. Nice shot. Okay, not as good of a shot. It's still not that great. He's not moving around a whole lot, and now you're being shot at. Honk it, honk it. Accidentally reload or something. I don't know if that boat has a horn, actually. The boat that they're on. There's obviously that one. That one has a horn. I know for sure, because I honk it religiously. Lighting change also dovetails nicely with something that they talked about in the, like, the roadmap, and they said there's going to be dynamic weather and lighting events happening on the map. So I wonder if this was like, I, I'm just curious how this came about, right? Like, did they sit down and think, oh, wow, there's a solar eclipse happening? Because I don't, you know, it's not on my calendar. I always just find out via social media or something else that there's some large lunar solar event happening. But like, maybe it was on their calendar years ago, and they're like, you know what we're going to do? We're going to do this on the solar event. Or is this just a beta test to make sure that like it works and they can do it? Shoot them. Thank you. Seven kills. Ooh, I think they killed each other. Nope, they're still there. Oh, wow. They picked up their guns and beamed immediately. Who is this demon? That's just a box. Those... Oh, you're getting... Full. This is a good, good player. They, they will likely win this gunfight. Not the person we're watching. Oh! I lied! I lied! Stop the presses! Cranky bouncing the throwing knife, hitting the snipe of their life! Quick, get back. Fire sale's about to end. On another recon, so they now know where... They should know where most people are. Is Cranky maybe the best sniper we've ever seen? Because that person also has a sniper rifle. We are now in a snipper-snapper duel. Resurgence was still active when they killed that demon down here, and their, their timer was definitely active. The aim down sight on this is great. I think someone in the comments said that it's like the... Oh, water tower. Look, I already executed him once. No way they're still up there. Don't stand still. You're going... Oh, they are sandwiched. Sniper glints also look more pronounced. Is that... That's the right word. Yeah, pronounced. More visible. Precision coming in. That came from someone down here. So there's someone water tower, someone there, and then that person right up on the hill who's fighting for their absolute life. It's always the easy ones that are the hardest to hit, too. Uh-oh. You have to rotate into... It, I, I must have missed the memo of snipers only because, like... Hold on. Is that Damascus? Wait, go investigate. Those camos look so weird. Damn it. The fact that that was, like, even somewhat doable with the Renetti really just goes to show how good it is. Vaz. Oh, I never knew that the Vaz Nev was named after them. I'm assuming their last name is Nev, right? Six kills. I mean, all the, all the sh movement. Oh, the MTZ looks nice. Or, you know, or the cheating. But, like, I think, I think the MTZ just looks nice. That's Renetti. I'm Renetti Crime. That's what that is. Pacheco! This is the running back for the uh, Kansas City Chiefs. Holy shit. Pacheco? By the way, if you don't have a pair of these glasses, please don't look at the solar eclipse. I feel like that's my duty is like, I don't know, someone with a brain and a platform to remind people who don't have brains that like, don't look at a solar eclipse. It will mess you up. It can mess up your eyes. That might actually be the last solar eclipse you look at. You might not even make it to 2044. It takes a special type of human to actively look at a solar eclipse. Three people left. Who is going to win the inaugural eclipse game on Rebirth Island? Part of me also hopes that they just don't, like, the second the eclipse is done, they just take it away. Or, you know, eclipse day. So tomorrow should just be back to regular again. And just never, never even acknowledge it. Gaslight the entire COD base into thinking that, like, no, what are you talking about? We never changed the lighting. Can, can we get a move on? here. I want to go honk the horn on the boat. Oh, I put up the counter UAV. That'll show everybody. I think someone's above them. I mean, everyone's shooting their sniper rifles. What was your other gun again? Did this person also not get the sniper's only meta or memo? Oh, they have claymores up. Got it. So they're in this for the long haul. They have a durable. Checking bottom showers. Nope, you have the showers to yourself. Just don't use all the hot water. The issue is top prison's gonna be in, and this might come down to a, I mean, Warzone doesn't have heal offs, but I'd like to call them gas masks off. Whoever takes their gas mask off first loses. Technically you can have stems, yada, 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 the irradiated perk, but like really it boils down to, do you have a gas mask or do you not? Checko, you have the best gun in the game. As long as they don't have the best gun in the game, you're gonna win the gunfight. Emotionally, I'm pretty invested in them winning. Please just go outside and look. 
Also, uh, what happens when you fly away? Does the, wait, the sun come back when you win? That would be cool. Because the eclipse itself doesn't last for that long. You know, obviously it, it happens at different points in time. There's places on the map where like you get a total eclipse. Everyone keeps talking about Cleveland, like something good is happening in Ohio. Cleveland's going to have a nice part of the solar eclipse. This is kind of thin line stretching across the United States. I mean, it's happening all over the world, but like as an American, I refuse to acknowledge that any other country or continent exists. Anyway, back to Checo, who is just pre-aiming for their life here. There's one. Uh-oh. They also have the best gun in the game. Run away. Now they have to reload the best gun in the game. Here we go. It's a 1v1 for the win. They have taken the top floor. Not top floor, but the other person's downstairs, so... Here we go. Find yourself in the epicenter. They got the win. Let's see what happens when they fly away if the sun comes back. Sun is back, sun is shining, sun is out. We're honking horns real quick because I said I would, I'm a man of my word. If you made it this far in the video and you're not subscribed, you should just do it, honestly. Like, what, what do you gotta lose here, right? You're watching a person on the internet honk a horn on a boat. There's one, I don't know how long I have to wait. What's the cooldown scenario here? Can I do it again immediately? Two, three. Do I get anything or am I being trolled? I'm being trolled, guys. Yeah, this is not real. Get off my boat. But yeah, guys, as always, I hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you tomorrow. Oh, yeah, just give on up so the video ends. Thanks.